Hello! I haven't made a video in a while, so I wanted to kind of tell you what's been going on with a game that everyone knows. Since it's a pretty easy game to tell you what's going on with, it's Super Mario Brothers! Exactly the way you remember it. With no kind of gimmick or anything. I mean, don't you remember Super Mario Brothers? It had this in the original. Didn't have that in the original. With me dying and all. But anyway. If you haven't seen the channel comment, most of my laziness hasn't been coming from school, while that is a factor. It's just that I'm getting kind of bored of Dragon Quest Monsters Joker. Don't get me wrong, it's a... I should really pay attention. Don't get me wrong, it's an okay game. It's just probably because I've been playing too many similar monster-raising RPGs that I'm getting bored of them. So I don't know whether or not I'm going to continue it. I might also X a few other games out because I kinda said yes to way too many things. I'm just focusing more on talking than actual playing this stupid thing. Let's continue. Uh... So, some... I might just drop some games because... It kind of feels more forced once I do a game that's request than a game I actually wanted to do. And then, it get, and then I get bored of it or I don't want to see it through and then... Things like this happen where I don't do anything for a while and then I basically... Avoid all comments and such except for every now and again. Well, some of them don't need responses, because not everyone needs a response for, like, Hey, good job, dude, and all that. Or, you suck. Comments like those don't really need a resp response from me. But, yeah. I'm planning on dropping, probably, Dragon Quest Monster Joker. Uh, what else on the list? I think that, uh, Pokemon Dungeon game, uh, and it's not like, I don't want anyone to take this, like, personally, where, oh, you dropped my game instead of other person, instead of random person number five's game, I hate you forever. It's not like that. And I'm not trying to make it, like, uh... Where, if your game get dropped, you should have chose a game that's more in my favor. No, I like trying new games every once in a while. It's just that. Honestly, I'm bored with some of them. And I'm trying to do this in the most, in the least internet drama way I can. It's kind of hard. Because I don't want to make it seem like, Oh, life is so hard. Uh, I can't do any of this stuff right now. Meh. No, I don't want to be whiny like that. I know people have their own problems. I'm not trying to make fun of anyone specific, but... But this is getting kind of awkward, so that's why I'm saying but every quite frequently. And dying quite frequently, because I haven't played this in forever, so in the few months that I haven't played any of this, I've gotten horrible at it again. That and because I'm not paying attention at all. But I mostly just chose this game because I don't mind whether or not I make absolutely no progress in it.
but back to the topic at hand. I might also drop, uh... Oh, what's the game called? I'm drawing a blank here. That, uh... Fighting game. I'm totally drawing a blank, but I think most people will notice that it's the only fighting game on the list, so hopefully that doesn't cause any confusion. Uh, what else? I've actually forgotten what's on the list, so I might just pause the video really quick and take a peek at it, because I'm drawing blanks, so... I might make more sense after I take a quick peek at it. Okay, so I, after taking a look, the fighting games jump ultimate stars, and I'll definitely probably drop Digimon World DS simply because it it creates the same problem as Dragon Quest Monsters Joker, obviously. <laughs> you can prolong the levels by doing this. Uh. I'm um, not sure whether or not I'm going to drop Phoenix Wright. I may or may not. I definitely won't be dropping The World Ends With You because I basically have that whole thing recorded. I still have to narrate most of it, but other than that, it's basically fully recorded. Well, the main game, anyway. I'm still working on getting the secrets and such. So that's basically... I'm dropping pretty much everything except for platinum I might not keep either I may or may not it really depends so this video title should probably be I'm dropping everything and basically saying I quit no I don't want to stop let's playing it's just that I don't want to play games that will in turn bore me Maybe it's because I'm just, I don't know, have a very short attention span. Maybe it's just that things that I don't know where to go and don't know what everything to do get boring after a while, but whatever it is. It's just like that. Which is completely hypocritical of me saying because I'm excited about new games coming out. Which I, in fact, will have to learn. But those are things you don't really need to know about. Uh, let's see, let's see. I guess this will really be a test whether or not people who are actually my fan base will watch, were watching me for me or watching me just play the games with some f commentary they found humorous. I really hope it's the first thing. It would, it would kind of suck if everyone unsubscribed to me because I basically the only way I really know who's watching me are the subscribers. And I'm not uh, saying that you shouldn't unsubscribe ever to me. If you want to unsubscribe, feel free. It's not like I'm forcing you to stay there and watch my videos through the internet. And I'm not going to sit there and beg for subscriptions either. Because in the end, it's really all a popularity contest, is it not? One thing I don't get, though, is how that screeching harpy Fred has so many subscribers. But that's one of the mysteries of life.
I don't real I don't know how long I've been talking. And I've been dying at the same stupid Goomba. For those who don't know, the rules of this game is basically like Kirby's Canvas Curse. But it, what's different is... It's Super Mario Bros. 3, so it's basically... You're on a track, and you've got to sometimes fight against it to actually do the things that you have to time for. So it does... Cr creates some problems, but there's also neat little tricks you learn about the ROM placement and all that stuff. <laughs> 